the question of, of wireless. Again, you can have a more or less competitive structure. You're beginning to see in the US with the new uh, announcements from uh, 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 the chairman of the FCC of putting open internet on the mobile uh, as well. Again, for the same reason of concerns of insufficient competitiveness. Uh, the proprietary solution potentially, instead of public investment, may be open wireless networks. Um, uh, if we have them here, and here there are some interesting potentials uh, uh, and possibilities, obviously. Um, let me not get into these uh, details. I can come to that if people are interested uh, uh, later. Um, let's talk about devices. We have essentially two evolutionary path paths. We have the open standards-based systems, and we have the proprietary systems that run through the operators, and both of them have uh, uh, have their own traditions, uh, uh, one that was more generative and open, the other that was more closed. Um, and one of the major questions as we move to ubiquity is how this remains, or not remains, how this becomes open. The path of least resistance in terms of the organizational uh, 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 pathway and stability what the habits are, what the contracts are, who controls in terms of the relationships with the operators. The pathway is towards a more closed system. That means you don't have the same level of control. That's why Android is such a strategic intervention, assuming that all things considered, it'll actually work in that way as opposed to be more uh, controlled. Um, will the iPad that's being sold as one of these but is a passive uh, uh, reading device uh, make the difference? I don't know. Um, the handheld evolutionary path is so critical because of ubiquity, because of ubiquitous computation, and comes from the owned and controlled historical path. Um, and here we have the question, right? So at one level, App Store, hundreds of thousands of applications, easy, et cetera, everything, but a controlled system, as opposed to not. That's a critical question, whether what we'll see is market adoption that will drive, if we're looking to a point at which the core question that drove the change, which is to say radically distributed capital capabilities to innovate over a system that allows you to innovate or not. Um, do we need behavioral regulation? Do we need uh, uh, to just wait to see what happens in the market? Uh, hard to tell, but this is one critical new thing that is potentially moving us away from a system of open innovation. I won't get into the standards and, and, and this, everybody's spoken about this, but this is obviously critical for all of the reasons that were uh, stated. We also have the interests of content owners pushing regulation down into uh, uh, the regulation.